what, just give us a bit about flow. What is flow? And, and, and can you just describe a bit about the definition of it? Yeah, I, I, I can. And it's a good question. So I think if we keep it simple, the flow state means really that all of you is moving in the same direction. So what does that mean? It means that if you have a goal in life, maybe you want to make more money or you want a new business or you want to buy a new house or you want a new partner or you want to be the next level sports person or whatever your goal is, it doesn't matter. You know, again, this is not about being an elite sportsman. Everybody's got a mind, you know, and we've all got a body. Uh, and if you can use the mind well, then it's a hell of a lot easier to, to you know, to flow through life. So the flow states about all of you, when I say that, I mean all of you subconscious processes are in alignment with what you consciously want to achieve. So that's a flow state, but then we have to remember, oh, we're also, we're in a body, we're in a physical body. So there are aspects of your physiology that need to be balanced, like your blood sugar, for example, having enough food in you, making sure you've, you haven't had any food intolerances where you've, you've got inflammation. So there are many things in the body that you need to really tick the box to make sure that all of you is moving in the right direction. And that's what I call it. And the flow really sort of says what it is. It's a flow through your day without inner resistance. And that's the key, Mike. It's a flow being able to experience and access, let me say it this way, being able to access your skills, knowledge, and experience with ease, mm. without any inner resistance. And that inner resistance could be mindset, you know, negative emotions, limiting beliefs, in a dialogue that doesn't serve you, support you. And it can be, you know, blocks in the physical body. As I say, you haven't balanced your blood sugar, you're eating the wrong foods, you're not overly healthy in the physical body. When you get those two right, then you can flow. But the real key to flow, and this is something that's not overly spoken about, the real key to flow is what I said at the start, is making sure that subconsciously, what is happening at that subconscious level is taking you in the direction that you want to go. And that's the biggest issue for most of us, you know, that we have all these old outdated programs that we want to go this way, we want to make more money, we want, you know, a nice life and, and all the things. Um, but actually, subconsciously, what's firing off in your physiology subconsciously isn't allowing that, you know, switching your brain off, causing stress, negative inner dialogues, negative emotions, so that you end up, it's really, really hard to flow when that's happening. Mm. So the flow state is when all of you is moving in the right direction without any resistance. Right.